Hey guys, my name is episode 5 is the game. The last episode, we got a message from an anonymous sender um, called Alibaba. And they were telling us that we need to take care of, I think, we had to do them a favor or we had to take care of someone and they would give us information on Medjet or something like that. I can't quite remember all the details. Uh, and in this episode, we are going to wait for more contact from Alibaba. And let me go to my messages really quick so we can just see what exactly was sent to us, yeah. Okay, yeah, there's someone whose heart they want us to steal. And they can give us information on them, on Medjid, if we do it correctly. If we do what they want. Okay, so that's what we're gonna do. And in this episode, we are going to wait for more contact from them. I don't think that we can do anything else tonight. I think we need to go straight to bed. Uh, I'm pretty sure. Okay, uh, yeah, houseplant's taken care of. I guess we just need to go straight to bed. Um, can I do that? That'd be nice. Okay, go to bed. Hmm. Yep, our rate is going down a little bit. That's interesting. I just saw it go down from 37. I wonder why. I guess it's the whole Medjid business. People are, uh, Medjid saying that, um, they've defeated us. And that's why... I'm surprised there hasn't been a more drastic spike. Yeah, what does that mean? That was my question. Hmm, yeah. Oh gosh, is it them? Oh no, okay, cool. It's it's Ryuji. And for all we know that for all we know, Alibaba's viewing this message right now too. Come on. Ah. Uh, I know how that is when you're waiting in anticipation for like an email to come through or for a message to come through. Every buzz you think this is it and then it's not, and it just makes you more and more anxious about it. Oh, but this time it's not Ryuji, is it? The music playing, like, really sets the mood. It gets me scared, actually. Good day. Good day to you, too! Who are you again? Oh, so it was you. I knew it. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Still from who? What's the target's name? Yeah, you, um, clearly... You know a lot, but you don't know all the fine details. Hmm, one moment. Wait a moment. Huh? Futaba Sakura. Hold up. Hold the phone. Okay, I'm confusion. So I thought this person was Futaba. I thought that this- okay, so yeah, I know that Futaba is a girl who um, has red hair and she works at a computer. That's all I know about her. But we- I know- and I know that's the girl that we've been seeing in those cutscenes. I thought that girl was sending us these messages, but she wouldn't have us wanting to steal her own heart. We have to steal the heart of Futaba? Really? Who are you? <laughs> Part of me wants to ask, but I gotta ask this. Who is Futaba? Darn it! I should, I should, should have asked. 
I should have asked that. Who is this? Hmm. For real? Well, that's a very typical name. Yeah, we should definitely tell the others. On sitting in front of us, <laughs> doesn't even know what's going on right now. But uh, we'll tell everybody after school. We're gonna get reported if we don't do this. What the hell? Yeah, I know. I don't like being forced into something like this. Taba Sakura? Wasn't Sakura? Huh? Why it's boss's last name? Wait a moment. Wait a moment. Huh? That is, his name is Sojiro Sakura. Okay, come on. Okay, I felt like I knew that. In the back of my head, I knew that. But I was just thinking that Sakura was kind of like, common. Does he have any family? Well, we don't really know Where's anything he? about him. Yeah. For reals? How laid back are you? <laughs> Oh, uh. <laughs> Wouldn't you normally be introduced at least? I mean, you are living at his place. Well, his situation does make things difficult. Mm -hmm. Calling card was delivered to Boss's house. It'd be more natural to assume this is all related. Hmm. But then again, that is where we're staying, so it could just be a coincidence. One of the reasons for that is because Alibaba mentioned nothing about which Futaba Sakura. Perhaps he thinks that the name alone is enough. That makes sense. I believe it's adequate for us to think that this is the doing of someone close by. I see. I don't know how Alibaba got a hold of his smartphone information. However, since he's ordering us through chat, I do feel as though he's taunting us. You mean... This might just be a prank? I don't think it's just a prank. I mean, look at his demands. Pay me if you don't want me to leak who you really are. That I'd understand. But he's telling us to steal someone's heart without explaining why. So we're being tested. Hmm. Regardless, I think we should ask boss about Futaba Sakura once. That's probably for the best. He's gonna wonder how we got that person's name. There's nothing else we can do at the moment, and Chief might have an idea on what this is about, too. I'll check the school's roster just in case. Yeah. We must make sure Boss doesn't figure out who we are. We'll have to go about this cautiously. Very cautiously. I, I can't even think of how we're gonna casually ask, Hey, do you know a Futaba? Oh yeah, I bumped into her. Like, what? <laughs> no. Uh, I don't know. This is gonna be interesting. If she is related, that's gonna be insane. It's gonna make things a little sticky, too. Hmm? What's up? We're already being unnatural. I want to meet Futaba. Uh, I'll just say who's Fut I guess this is the most caught, like, easy Why do you say. know about that? What do you mean, why do I know about that? About what? Uh oh. It's got nothing to do with you. I'm going home. Make sure you lock up the place. So there definitely is something there. Looks like it's a hit. Mm hmm. Surprised we, we didn't ask us any more questions. Yeah, I tried. Where have you been? Thank you. I would prefer not for that to happen either. So we just have to wait? Mmm, more waiting. Ah, uh, I don't know if I like this. Okay, well, 
Just gotta be cautious and just wait and look into Futaba. Interesting stuff. Okay. Table. So, how do I watch DVDs? Maybe I just can't tonight? But, like, I've been trying to do that for a while and I thought I could watch DVDs at home because I got that, like, DVD player, I thought. Uh, but maybe certain nights I can do that and I just have been unlucky with checking the TV. I don't know. Is there, is there really anything that I can do tonight? Yep, I need to go straight to bed. Okay. Mm. Yeah, we just have a bunch of names and a bunch of puzzle pieces. It's like... We have a, a literal puzzle, but we have pieces that aren't connected at all. We don't, we can't. We just have dots and no links between them. Hopefully we get some more answers tomorrow. But if we do, it's not gonna be on our accord or by our doing. It's gonna just be whenever someone decides to give it to us. Oh, hey Ryuji. Dude, what do you mean, this lame shit coming up? What are you talking about? <laughs> it's possible, actually. Wow. That's a good idea. <laughs> You're gonna have to, but okay. It's still a good idea, though. But if Sojiro finds out that we're been, that we're poking around behind his back, he probably won't be very happy. But we probably are gonna have to do some poking around. <laughs> oh yeah, that is really lame. Cold water? Uh, oh, well I guess it is summer. Okay, sorry, I'm, I'm playing this in the perspective of it's January and I'm freezing. <sighs> wait, wait, hold up, you're a cat. Why do you want to hop in water? <laughs> sorry, I, I just realized that. Uh, that doesn't add up. Maybe, yeah, okay, I'm positive now. Morgana can't be a cat if Morgana wants to hop in water. I mean, like that would give it away right there. Okay, I guess that's what we're doing. I was hoping to maybe do some other things first, but I guess not. Hmm. So here we are in the back streets. Just gotta wander around and ask some people. Let's start with the dazed old man. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's the Futaba. I think that Futaba would, um probably be past maybe by this point or would be very 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 elderly hmm I'm not sure yeah I don't know if this person would be his daughter or what what oh okay I, okay I was really confused for a second I didn't see that it said that the DJ was talking yeah, well, okay. I don't think there's anybody back here, is there? Wow, this is like really hidden, what the heck? Okay, no. Uh, nothing back here. Wow, this is like a very, very, very tight area. Gosh, this is so cramped. Uh, neighborhood housewife. I think I already talked to you, right? Yep. I already talked to you. Um, I never talked to this guy in here. Wait, when I talk to him, is he just gonna try to sell me stuff or? Oh, okay. Well, maybe I should go back there later. Uh, so we went down that street. And there's some people up there we can talk to, but let's explore this area first. Okay. So, nothing there. I wonder if we need to go inside any buildings? Uh, I'm gonna rule out the people on the street before I 
try to look there. By the way, do you eat a lot? What are you talking about? Hey, I'm a growing boy. <laughs> yeah, he probably does eat a lot. But that's a good thing. Uh, old man? Hmm. Okay, yeah, that person over there is the last person. The only one that I have not asked yet. Let's go ask them. Why would he buy a bunch of food for someone who's not in his day-to-day -day life? That doesn't really make any sense unless he swings it by somewhere and drops it off. I guess that's possible, but I suppose we should go by the store. Here's our local supermarket. Huh. That doesn't look like it'll work. Okay, so I jumped through all the hoops that I had to of going around and asking people, so we just gotta ask him again? I don't know if that's gonna go over well. Oh, wow. Gosh. You read the letter, did you not? You are not having, a, uh, not having an easy time between the two of us, are you? So you're the one who tipped him off about Futaba. Wait, what? You really shouldn't have done that. I have no intention of talking to you about Wakaba. Tipped off? What are you talking about? Who's Wakaba? Back to the matter at hand. Your parental authority will have to be suspended. I take it you're okay with that outcome? What? Parental authority? Considering the state of your daughter and your family overall, there are no points in your favor. So you do have a daughter. Would you like to take this to domestic court? Our chances of victory are roughly 99.9% .9 though. So you're with the mother who's trying to win custody, is that right? With these suspicions of abuse, there's no way you could avoid having your custody revoked. Suspicions of abuse? You're going that far? I told you I don't know a damn thing about it. We're extremely serious about this. As long as there's a possibility that cognitive science can be linked to psychotic breakdowns. Fine. I yield. Gosh. Thank you. I will contact you at a later date. I doubt you'll find anything you want to hear, though. That's fine. It will be up to us to decide whether the information you give us is useful or not. Next time I come here, it will just be for a nice cup of coffee. I would rather you not come back, actually. I'm sure he would, too. And stay out! Gosh. That woman is real good at pissing people off. <sighs> What's with that look? You got something to say? <sighs> this doesn't involve you. That's enough. Just behave yourself and keep going to school if you don't want me to throw you out of here. You got that? Lock the store up. Wow. The existence of this Futaba is for certain. She may be in some kind of bad situation, though. More so, our conjecture that Alibaba is connected to LeBlanc seems to have a pretty solid foundation. But how are they connected to LeBlanc? I, I, I don't quite get that. Like, I don't see the connection there. Like, I know, like, he came, he must have, he or she must have come by here and put it in the mailbox. I get that. But could they just have been doing that because they know that this is where we stay? Oh, and didn't they mention cognitive something? 
Yeah, that completely went over. Like, I, I, I don't understand that at all. I wonder what the chief's hiding. Yeah, these allegations of abuse. Doesn't that doesn't sound like him? I mean, he, he's kind of a stiff guy, but never have we gotten that sense from I him. Can't really press him on the subject though, especially after he mentioned throwing you out. Yeah, that'd be bad. Hmm. This is tough stuff. Wow, it's been like three solid days of the game running. Like, I mean like, running us, like we don't get to choose our day. <laughs> like, it's just been story, story stuff for the past few days. Um, okay. Well, here we are once again, and I bet I can't do a damn thing tonight besides go to bed, right? Yep, okay. To sleep. Mm. Yep, let's go to sleep. Sleep sounds really nice right now, but I'll be up for a few more hours doing homework after this. Uh, man, life as a college student. Anyways, what's gonna happen today? A woman was threatening boss? Oh yeah, and that woman was her sister. Yeah, she was going on about domestic abuse and taking the case to court and stuff. Can't we just say outright that that's- wait, I guess us the protagonists don't know at this point in time that this is- that was Makoto's sister, do we? No, we would have no way of knowing. Oh. What's up? Please tell me you realize. It's nothing. So to summarize what you told us, Futaba is boss's daughter, and he's abusing her? That's what things are pointing towards, but I don't know if I buy the whole abusing her part. I mean, then again, you never, I mean, a lot of times, people who do that sort of thing, who do awful things, people around them will say things like, I never would have guessed. So I guess you never really know a person, but I don't know. I still don't think so. I don't know him very well. Is he really the kind of person who would do that? I really don't think so. Maybe... I don't know... I wish there was an answer between... I wish there was an I don't think so. Um... I'm gonna say this. I would like to believe so as well, but we don't have any conclusive evidence, do we? We don't. Is it Alibaba? Yep. Haha, ah, okay, thank goodness there, it, there wasn't the scary music this time, because that music really does put me on edge. What a selfish person. Yep. Well, he does have information on us. We should do what they say. Anyways, this Futaba he's talking about have a palace? If so, we'll need keywords to get in. Try messaging him about it. Does she have a palace? Tell me her keywords. That'll probably get to our answer the quickest. What are we supposed to do about this? We'd be able to figure out Alibaba's identity if we could just meet with him. Try asking him if there's any way we could meet up. I doubt this will happen. Huh? Just like that? Are you kidding me? You're calling the deal off? Whoa, okay, okay, what? And you're just gonna say for this ever happened, you're not gonna report us? Why? Sorry for taking our time? Who is this? I got whiplash from this 180. Wait a second. Yeah, we're not done here. Ah. Uh. Huh? Did he just shut the whole operation down? Okay, don't answer this question, but please, 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 please tell me by the end of this game we figure out who, th who that was. Because if we don't ever figure out who that was, I won't be able to sleep. <laughs> I'm sure we will, but that bothers me. 
that doesn't add up at all. What the hell? I will, I don't I don't understand. This doesn't make any sense. It does not. Not only can Alibaba not go out, but he won't let us meet Futaba either. Well, it's none of our business now. We can't contact him anymore. Won't let us contact Futaba. Won't let us meet him. But what do we do about Medjed? We won't be able to get Alibaba to help us with them now. Maybe they were just pranking us. They made that huge declaration, but they ain't done nothing since. <laughs> I bet we got them freaked out. You mean they backed out because they're afraid we'll change their hearts? Whoa. That probably is why, actually. Yep. And now it'd just make them look lame if they came out and apologized. But... I guess with Alibaba and Medjet out of the picture, can we just say this case is closed? Nope, Ryuji. This game doesn't work that way. You do have a point. No, don't play the calm music like everything's done, no! I'm curious now. I guess it is safe for us to relax a little. Oh yeah, remember Kaneshiro's treasure? Prepare to have your minds blown. How much money did we get? We got 150,000 yen out of it. Converting, converting. Oh, so $150, is that right? That's awesome! We can really go all out with that kind of money. Yeah! Let's make up for what happened at the fireworks festival. Or no, excuse me. A thousand dollars. That's like a thousand dollars. Wow, that's a lot of money. We gotta go eat something fitting for the Phantom Thieves worldwide debut. Mm, where would be good? Hmm. I don't know, we don't really know a whole lot of like up-in restaurants, high-end restaurants. Ooh, how about sushi? I could really go for some eel too. Sushi would be good, yeah. And it's not that often that you have a lot of money to splurge on some really nice stuff either. The best method is to fill yourself on ginger before beginning to eat sushi. That is my master technique. Oh yeah? You don't need to do that this time. Actually, definitely don't do it, okay? <laughs> I'm all for sushi. You're okay with that too, right? Okay, maybe you are a cat. Yeah, so she's fine. Then it's decided. All right, we'll go tomorrow night. Oh yeah, tomorrow's Sunday. That'd be a good night for it. Yeah. But I'm curious, <laughs> no! <laughs> this is gonna come back one way or another. It's got to. This is weird. Oh, well, who's this message from? No, I don't think it was. Cautiously enjoy the sushi. <laughs> Something's not right. Very true. The real question to be asked, <laughs> where have I been? <laughs> I'm a to Ryuji always gets crapped on, but it's funny. <sighs> well, 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 well. After an episode of what I thought we would get answers from, we get just more questions. Oh, I'm noticing the uh, the window's open now. That wasn't always the case, was it? Wait, action? Oh, when it said train, I was like, we can get on the train from here? <laughs> uh, I was being dumb. Anyways, yeah, I we have so many more questions than I do answers now. Uh, okay, but I think this is a good stopping point. So next time let's play Persona 5, uh, we will do things. I must up my order. Wait, yeah, thank you to my patrons. William Nintendo Black Crisis, Joseph from Bro Show, and Drew Had Dad. No, I had my order right. What am I saying? Next time on Let's Play Persona 5, we will be um, hopefully getting some more answers and less questions. Because if I get any more questions, I think I might just lose it. 
Uh, so I've been Kimrani, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys back here next time. Goodbye, guys.